El cinturón negro en karate, Giga Chikatsi, ha dejado un camino de destrucción en la división de peso pluma desde que se unió a la UFC en el 2019. Su habilidad en pelea de pie fue forjada por su carrera de kickboxing y la ha traído al octágono. Con finalizaciones sobre otros peleadores, el procedente de Georgia ya es considerado uno de los mejores de la división. Giga nos explica a profundidad algunas de sus técnicas favoritas en esta edición de Serie Exclusiva. Giga Chikaze! You're gonna get some wild world-class striking ahead of your way. So much snap on those shots, it really is beautiful. That's the karate style of Giga, who can kick you, head kick you, liver kick you. You can tell this is something he did for a long time and was very good at it. I started to train karate when I was four, and I spent many, many years in this style. When I was like 17, 18, I moved to Netherlands to learn Dutch style of kickboxing. I still use the same moves in UFC fights. So many different kicks in the arsenal. That's his famous kick right there. Just melt people with that left kick. My style is aggressive, entertaining, and explosive. Wow! She can't say with style points tonight! I'm Giga Chikaze, and this is my signature series. The overhand right. Overhand right is very important move in my style because I have a very strong power in my right hand. My overhand right comes from karate background. Now I'm using this in MMA. Most of the time I'm doing this move when my opponent does a jab. While he moving forward, slip a bit and throw the overhand. You generate all power from your body. It's like a wave which goes all into your fist. When I'm throwing my overhand, I'm aiming his head. Doesn't really matter where this is gonna land, but if it lands at the chin, I know this gonna be the knockdown or finish. Boom! Big right hand by Giga. Drops him. I used this against Omar Morales in the third round. I knew he was going to come with a jab. So while he's jabbing, I'm stepping with my left foot, doing my overhand, and it lands perfectly. Oh! Massive right hand! That's when your opponent goes down. He's hurt! Giga looking for the finish! And finally, Giga kick. Giga kick is my signature move that I used to use in karate, in kickboxing. That's the liver kick in the body. The pain of the kick is a little bit different. You get hit and it's kind of delay pain. His energy, his cardio, his power is not going to be the same as it was a minute ago. Huge shock in the body. To land this kick, I switch my orthodox stance to south pole. Range is very important. I'm staying outside distance and moving right side before I land my giga kick. Power of the giga kick comes from the hips. Best part of the foot to land is the last part of your foot, close to the toes. Whip the kick, hit the lever. You might need to test your opponent to find the right part of the lever. I throw a couple of body kicks. I'm gonna throw a couple of high kicks. And then I start to land the jab. When I realize that my opponent is covering his head, then I move a little bit right side and throw my body kick to the lever. Oh, that was a good body kick. With the cub, 
He was very aggressive. He was pushing the fight. Cub's trying to close the distance. I tested Cub with my left switch high kick from the orthodox stance. I switch and stayed in a south pull from there. Then I did the left straight. And once I come back, he was moving forward. Then I stepped my right leg, right side, and did the giga kick right in the liver. Oh, there it is. There's the giga kick. I knew that fight was already done. Trying to fight through it. Now we'll pounce on him, covered up. Giga kick, Cub experience full power of a Giga Kid. This prospect has officially arrived. I'm Giga Chikaze, and that was my signature series. Es evidente que la depurada técnica de Giga lo ha posicionado entre los mejores en una de las divisiones más peligrosas en la UFC. Y hacemos otra pausa, pero al regreso.